Hey guys, today I just wanted to say that I think Mr. Beast is really cool, and when I'm older, I want to marry him and have three kids with him. The first two will be twins named Pew and Dee, but Dee will be spelt like die. They will be born four and a half minutes apart. Then, three years and two months later, we will have another boy named Pi. When she is 17, Dee will beg us to let her change the spelling of her name to how it's pronounced, but we will say no, of course, because that would ruin the whole Pew D Pi thing. When she is 18, she will abandon our family and legally change her name to Coco Melon T Series because she is evil. Then Mr. Beast will do a challenge between Pew and Pi to see who can eat the most pie, and Pi will win. That will make him realize that he really likes pie, and over the next few years he eats a lot of pie and gets really obese. When me and Mr. Beast try to start an intervention to get him to stop eating, Pi will beat up Mr. Beast, so I will sue him. Pew, who went to law school, becomes his lawyer, so we disown him too. Pi will lose the case, and we will lock him in our basement, where we give him nothing to eat for the next five years except asparagus and sour cream. After those... After those five years, he will kill himself by stuffing his nose and mouth with asparagus so he can't breathe. The sadness of this will make Pew run away to Taiwan and change his name to Cheng An. There he will join a Taiwanese gang, and only 12 years later learn that the gang leader's brothers, half-sisters, mothers, nephews, uncles, cousin was his sister, Coco Melon T. Series. After four months of searching, he will finally find her in an abandoned shack in northern Wyoming, with nothing but a rubber chicken and five packs of watermelon gum. Chang Han and Coco Melon, or as she is now just called Coco, will write a series of books about their adventures, called Chang Han and Coco's Adventures. Since the book is 100% false, they will immediately get arrested for their fictional story, because that is apparently a crime these days. After five minutes in jail, they both go into comas and only wake up 200 years later, at which time they promptly die of confusion at what has happened. So, um, yeah, that's just, like, kind of why I think Mr. Beast is kind of cool.